we're not sustainable, we're not going to survive. <laughs> that is our goal in life as a farmer, to make sure that our land is left in better shape than it was you know, for the next generation. So it's very important to all farmers. We implemented, I guess, any conservation practice that is available, that we need on our farm. Dad was one of the first farmers to implement no-till in this area. We have the filter strips around the edges of our field to help filter the water as it goes into the creeks and the ditches. We use a lot of the precision planting tools, pretty much anything that's out there, at least we think we are, to prevent overplanting, to prevent overspraying of our crop protectants. We have field maps that we only apply fertilize where it's needed. We also have yield monitors on our combines, so we know that if there's certain areas of the field that need attention, we feel like those are good sustainable practices. The profitability without sustainability will not work. For a farmer, that means looking at new techniques, new uses, new ways to uh, use the implements that you have and producing a crop. So it's very important to be sustainable. Like I say, if you're not sustainable, down the road you're not going to be profitable. You can't have one without the other. Mm -hmm.